Chapter 8 The Universe Reading 29 Going into Space Many children think about going into space. A few may do it, but only after they train hard for many years. Most of us will never go into space. Or will we? Today, there are some companies trying to build rockets for anyone to go into space. These companies believe that lots of people want to go into space to see what it is like. They think that, soon, going into space will be a usual thing to do. These companies are not thinking about only sending people into space. They also want to make money by carrying things from one place to another. Carrying things on ships and trains can take a lot of time. By spaceship, things can be moved much faster. Also, things must always be carried to and from space stations. Space companies also want to make money by carrying these things. When things are used a lot, they become much cheaper to make and use. When spaceships become used more often, they will cost less money to use. Who knows? Some days soon, it may cost about the same to go into space as it does now to go around the world. Reading 30 Exoplanets Books and movies about going into space are often about unusual and interesting new planets. But are there really planets going around other suns? In the last few years, scientists have answered that question. We have found thousands of planets around other suns. We call these planets exoplanets. Exo means outside because they are outside the planets around our sun. As of 2017, scientists have found more than 3,000 exoplanets. Because they are so far away, we can't see them using our eyes. Scientists must think of other ways to know if they are there. If a star's energy goes down and back up again, it can be because a planet moved in front of it. Years. Many of the things we use every day come from mines. Now, some people think that we should start mining in space. Many companies are getting ready for space mining. One idea is to go to a field of large space rocks between Mars and Jupiter. Reading 32 Space Elevators Elevators help people move up and down in large buildings, but some people believe that we can build an elevator all the way up into space. It sounds like a very unusual idea, but many scientists think it can be done. They say it would be good to have a space elevator because we could go up and down without using spaceships, so it would not cost a lot of money. What would a space elevator look like? The idea is to put a long cable from the Earth up to something far away in space. Elevator cars would then go up and down the cable to a kind of space station near the other end. The same cars could go up and down many times. Making an elevator will not be easy. What will be at the end of the cable?
One idea is to push a large space rock into place. Another idea is to bring together old spaceships and other things that are already up around the Earth. However, the biggest job may be making a cable for the space elevator. This cable must be very strong, much stronger than any cable we can make today.